Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, before this video starts, I have a big announcement for you guys. Some of you may know this already, and a lot of you have been trying to guess what it is, but none of you have got it yet. So, my announcement is that I have a P.O. box. So, this is my P.O. box address. If you want to send me a letter or anything, I will probably make a video of me opening it, and your name will get a shout out. So, yeah, feel free to send me anything you like, and I can't wait to open it and you'll get to see my face and I can't wait to just like respond to all your letters and read them all so yeah without further ado let's get on with the video Good morning everybody, it is very early in the morning at quarter to six and this is the time I wake up most mornings just to be prepared um, to start my day because Sophie is an early riser, unfortunately, but we do go to bed quite early just to make up for this. Um, so once I'm awake and turn off my alarm, the first thing I'll, I will do is take Sophie over to the nappy changing station, just because she's usually a bit stinky in the morning, so it's best to get her all cleaned up and nice smelling before she has her first feed of the morning. Once cleaned up, I will take her with me into the kitchen to make her first bottle of the morning. So in the morning, Sophie is quite clingy and likes to be held until she has her first feed. So I'm trying to get her out of this habit, but it's quite hard to break. So for now, I am just carrying her and trying to do everything one-handed, which is very hard. So I'm slowly mastering it, but hopefully Sophie will eventually learn that she can't be in my arms the whole time. So yeah. Once I have the bottle made, I will make a little space on my bed just to feed her, usually somewhere comfortable, just so I'm comfy while feeding her basically. So yeah, um, this is what we'll do for about an hour and after that I usually interact with her, after burping her of course, and just like talk to her and you'll see, just like play with her, kiss her and all that sort of stuff. After playtime, I usually make a little comfy spot on my bed just while I open the curtains and get her outfit out for the day. So yeah, and then after that I will pick her up and take her over to the changing station once again. And I usually don't have to change a nappy by now because it's just been changed like an hour ago. So I just change it into her outfit of the day.
when she was all clean and ready for the day, I then took her and put her in her car seat just because I was planning to do a bit of work at a cafe this morning and we also needed some shopping because I had no food in the house. So yeah, I just decided to take her with me. I didn't get any clips in the cafe, so that's... Yeah, yeah, I didn't get any clips. But while she was in her car seat and taking her first nap in the morning, I went and had a shower and just got ready for the day with a little bit of makeup. I don't usually do much just because it's extra time in the evening to take it off. So yeah, I also made my bed and just tied it up a bit just while Sophie was asleep. So now that we're both all ready, it's finally time to go. So I kept Sophie's nappy bag in the car just so I don't have extra stuff to carry down the stairs. Also, my shoes are outside and so was my backpack full of all my school books and stuff. Uh, because we live in an apartment block, then I can keep stuff outside and it's pretty safe. So yeah, now we are finally heading out and I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you all very soon. Bye!